Hello, I'm doing a movie review, and the movie I want to review is Halloween 2. Now, Halloween 2 came out in 1981, and this, of course, is a sequel to John Carpenter's 1978 horror classic, Halloween. Now, Halloween 2, um, now, John Carpenter doesn't come back to direct this movie, but he does co-write the screenplay for this movie with Deborah Hill. Hill, and him and Deborah Hill also produced the movie. Now, Halloween 2 um, picks up directly where Halloween 1 left off. Basically, um, Halloween 1 ended where, um, Sam Lo where, you sh where you saw Sam Loomis shoot Michael Myers, and he thought he killed him, but at the very end of the movie, he goes to check on the body, and he sees that Michael Myers' body is no longer there. So this picks up directly where that movie left off, and it and it's set on the same night as Halloween 1. What happens is, um, Laurie Strolt is taken to the hospital, um, suffering from stab wounds, and, uh, what happens is now you realize that Michael Myers is still on the loose, and, um, basically the basic plot line of the movie is Michael Myers goes to the hospital, um, where Laurie Strolt is at, and he goes to kill her, and, um, you know, and he basically, like, he starts killing people in the hospital, um, that's the basic plot line of the movie, but, um, what I like about this movie is it, um, you know, it really does, like, it picks right, picks up right where Halloween 1 left off, so it's like, so it's almost like a direct continuation of the first one, and it goes, and it goes together really well with the first one as well, um, you know, but what happens is, in the movie, you find out that Laurie Strolt is actually Michael Myers' sister. Like, um, you find, you find out that Michael Myers' parents had another child, and what happens is, she ended up going off, she ended up getting put off for adoption, because you find out that Michael Myers' parents, um, were killed, and, um, you know, so she ended up getting put off, put up for adoption, so in this movie, you find out that that um, Lori Strolt is actually Michael Myers' sister, and that's why Michael Myers was going after her. Um, yo, but uh, Halloween Two is definitely a really good sequel, um, and. And I have to say, this is probably one of the only good, like, really, really good sequels to Halloween, because, um, because I'm not the biggest fan of the Halloween franchise. Like, I love the first one, and I really like this one, but in my opinion, really the best Halloween movies are the first three. Um, after Halloween 3, um, and yes, I do like Halloween 3, but after Halloween 3, to me, the series really goes downhill, with the exception of Halloween 4 and Halloween H2O, um, the rest of the Halloween sequels really sucked, in my opinion. Well, you know what, I shouldn't say that, because it's been a while since I've seen any of them, but, um, I am gonna be re-watching them, and I am gonna be, um, doing a review on all the Halloween movies, um, you know, and now, normally when I review movies in a franchise, I normally don't review the remake. Like, um, last year I reviewed all the Friday the 13th movies, but I did not review the remake because I don't include remakes as part of the franchise. Um, this year I'm gonna break that rule because, and I am gonna be reviewing Rob Zombie's remake of Halloween, um, only because, um, there's actually a lot I want to say about that movie, but, um, yeah, Halloween 2 is definitely a decent sequel, I would definitely recommend it and